Hey guys, this is Spartacus here, and welcome to another video where I got some Black Ops 3 gameplay for you guys, but we're not going to be talking about that game here. We're actually going to be talking about Treyarch's next Call of Duty game coming out in 2018, which is quite a ways away from now because, of course, the next Call of Duty game that will be coming out is on November 3rd, and that's Call of Duty World War 2, right? We already played the beta. We know what that game's kind of going to be like already, but after that will be Treyarch's next Call of Duty game, which, of course, we don't really have any information about, but we did, in fact, get some information not too long ago. It's more like a couple hours ago for me anyway that we found out that Treyarch's next Call of Duty game may actually take place during the modern day which I find to be really interesting because Treyarch has never made a Call of Duty game that has taken place in modern day so their very first Call of Duty game or actually I don't even know if it was their first Call of Duty game. I think they made Call of Duty 3 but I'm honestly not too sure about that but anyway their previous Call of Duty games like Call of Duty World at War which took place in during World War 2 and then there was a uh, Call of Duty Black Ops which took place during the Cold War then there was Black Ops 2 that took place in the future, then Block Ops 2 that also took place in the future, right? They've never made a Call of Duty game that took place in modern days, so I find it really interesting how they're deciding to go through the modern uh, kind of aspect of a military game rather than a future one that they've already done or going back to the past, which I, I don't know, I just find it really, really interesting that they're going with a modern Call of Duty game. Now, where is this information coming from? So, Treyarch has been posting on the internet about a bunch of job listings. They're looking for people to hire and they're looking for someone who's a system designer. Now, I got this information from Charlie Intel because they are always up to date with Call of Duty information. They are literally the best people to go to if you want to get news and information from them about like any Call of Duty game in general, basically. So anyway, on Charlie Intel's website, this is what they have to say. Little information is currently known about what Treyarch is working on for the 2018 Call of Duty title. However, a new job listing on Treyarch's site for a system designer combat may suggest that the 2018 title they are working on will be set in the modern era. The systems designer job has a requirement of deep knowledge base of firearms and modern military technology. So as you can see, they have proof right there on their website that there is a requirement of having deep knowledge of base of firearms and modern military technology. So they're looking for someone who has experience or knowledge of modern military technology, which kind of hints towards that maybe their next Call of Duty game might actually take place during the modern area. But this is really the only information we have right now but honestly if they say modern military technology then perhaps their next Call of Duty game will take place in modern day I find this to be really interesting if you ask me I find it to be pretty darn awesome because of course like I said before Treyarch has never made a Call of Duty game that has taken place during the modern day so I just find it really interesting also another thing I'd like to point out doesn't really have anything to do with like Treyarch's next Call of Duty game being modern day but also in the requirements underneath of what I just read to you guys underneath it I don't know if you guys saw this it says you have to be prestige one or above in black ops 3 multiplayer so what's kind of interesting they're looking for employees who have experienced of playing Call of Duty, which honestly is a smart thing to do because I wouldn't hire someone for a game that if they've never even played their your own video game before. So, but what's interesting is that you have to be Prestige One or above in Black Ops Three multiplayer. So it's kind of interesting how they use the their recent Call of Duty game um, and, instead of like Black Ops Two or even Black Ops to, in order to actually play their game. But anyway, I just wanted to point that out there. So anyway, like I said, you guys. The next Call of Duty game, or the next Treyarch Call of Duty game, I should say, is going to take place during the modern day, which I find to be really, really interesting. What are your guys' thoughts down below in the comments? I love to read them and reply to you guys if you have any questions. Of course, like this video if you enjoyed it, and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already for more Call of Duty videos later in the future, and I shall catch you guys later.